Hey guys, it's Heather. Guess what? We're doing a Timu haul today and we have a new addition to the family. <laughs> and she's little. She's just so little. Do you want to see everybody, Piper? Huh, Piper? Where's Piper? It's Piper! She's only seven weeks old. She's our little beagle. She got up at four this morning. <laughs> She did. She got up at four. Oh, are you tired because you got up at four? Oh, you poor little thing. This Piper. Um, that's why I kind of took a little bit of a break. We got her on Saturday, the day before Father's Day, and then we were just gonna relax on Father's Day. And then I was planning on recording something the Monday after. Today is Thursday. Thursday after Father's Day. So hopefully I can get this recorded, edited into you guys by Saturday. That's my goal. So if you see this after Saturday, I'm so sorry. So we're doing a Timo haul. I got quite a bit of stuff. Don't know how much of it we'll get through, but we're gonna we're gonna get through it, guys. We're gonna get through it. Right, Piper? Oh. She's probably tired from being up at 4 a.m. <laughs> so all I have in me is just to do a Timo haul. Poor Piper. All right, let's get into the Timo haul. Boop, boop. You guys, I, I am like super, super tired. I'm so tired. So I'm gonna apologize if I don't do things right. In this video, we're also gonna look at the um, Timu furniture that I got. I've only had them all put together maybe about two weeks, something like that. I don't know, all the days are like blurring together, but the big, big hutch that I have down in my dining room, I can't stress enough how awesome and beautiful that thing is. I really recommend that big hutch. I'm like really, really surprised on how the quality, and it's got glass doors. Like how did Timu get that to me? without the, the doors breaking. But they, they, uh, they did, they did it. I have some footage of me assembling some of the stuff and then um, the end product. So I'll show you guys that right here. Okay, so this little rack is gonna replace this. This thing is so junky. I just couldn't have a bunch of like clutter on it. So I'm gonna take this away and put that there instead.
all done. Um, these hinges are really nice. You can adjust them to go uh, to, for the whole door to go um, forward or back. Then you can adjust this one to have it go left or right if you need to get it just to fit just right. Soft close. The only thing I did wrong, I did mess up in here. I put this on backwards. Oops. Oh well. Soft close. Anyway, all right, let's, can we get into the hall here? I know some of y'all get like really, really crabby with me when I don't, when I don't get right to it. Like open that package right now because I can't wait one more second. Occasionally I get those comments where part of me wants to be like, you know what? I'm going to make you wait longer just because you said that. I could sit here all day. <laughs> I got nothing in the books today. Just this and making dinner. Don't push me. I'm tired. I'm just <laughs> Let's start with this little one. I actually did like open it and I took a little peek inside and then I saw what it was and then I went like that and I just went, whoa, that's Timu. I gotta wait to be with my subscribers, my friends, my subscriber friends. Anyway, let's start with that. I overpaid on this. Oh, that's right, I gotta get my, let me get my order up so that I can be giving you guys prices as I'm... I don't know what I was thinking, but I ended up paying shipping on this stupid thing. Yes! The thing by itself is $3.46. Maybe I should show you what it is. <laughs> so it's this little thing that helps you clean like your, your, you know, your water bottles, your Stanley, your Stanley dupes, your, your other little bottles that you have, maybe your coffee thermos where they have those little grooves and cracks and crevices. And it's supposed to like help you clean them properly. Cause have you guys seen like some people are growing mold. Like they have little science experiments growing inside the lids of their water bottles. Ew. So there's a three pack of them. They're fun colors. They don't feel real cheap and junky. They really don't. They actually feel really nice. So the fact that I paid what did I say? Six dollars in change for them, almost seven dollars for three of these. It's not bad. It's not terrible. It's not the the three forty six that I was hoping to pay for three of them. But so this side has got really coarse br uh, bristles, like it's more heavy duty. And then you've got this little brush, but then it rotates and it gives you a, like a little. Like a little blade, a little plastic blade if you need to get into a crack or, or to pop up the, um, I've got like a little silicone ring in there. Sometimes I can't get it out. Like I have to go get like a little knife, like a fork or something, get it in there to pop it out. So that would be really nice to have that to kind of help pop things out or, or just to like scrape. I don't know. Even with the $3 shipping, that's not bad, but I'm spoiled with shipping. Like Amazon, shopping Amazon Prime and then like Timu where if you reach a certain order then you have free shipping. Even on Alt, at Alta, I like to reach a certain point so I don't have to pay for shipping. <laughs> so when I get slapped with a shipping fee, like never mind. I don't want it. Never mind. I'm kind of a snob like that. Not really. You guys settle down. You know what I should do? You guys, you know what I should do? Maybe I'll raise my camera up a little bit. I'm going to change my camera angle. I'm going to raise it up and then like tilt it down a little bit so then you guys can hopefully maybe see. So just a second. I'm going to play with the camera angle. Just a second. Is that all right? You good? Just, just, just take one minute. Ouch. Ow, ow, ow. I think I, I think I went too far down. Let me change it again. I don't know. It, 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 let's just try it for this time. I feel like I'm lucky enough at you guys. <laughs> I don't know if I, just because I'm tired, but I don't know if this is a good idea or not. It might be a horrible idea. And then when I go to edit this, I'm going to be like, what was I thinking? But let's just try it. You can at least see a little bit more. You don't have to be like wondering like what I'm doing until I hold it up. 
See, that, that's my, that's my uh, overall thinking. I think it's crooked, hold on. There, is that a little better? I think that's a little better. Okay, now, all right, all right, all right, all right. Okay, so what I think I'm gonna do, because sometimes I struggle to share my links for my orders, um, I'll read off more of the title along with the price. So then just in case I can't share my order, you guys can at least like take some of those, at least some keywords and then go to Timu and like search it yourself. You know what I mean? How petty I am, but I'm excited I found pale pink. Usually I can't find pale pink. It's the little things that make me excited, okay? $1.99 and those are called 100 piece disposable micro applicator. Hope you can find it. Waterproof mascara. But it looked like a fancy violin. So I thought I would throw it in with the literal mountain of makeup that I have over there that I'm gonna do a Timu makeup review. I'm gonna start with a bare face and we're just gonna throw a whole bunch of Timu makeup on our faces. I've done it before, I'm gonna do it again. Can you come out please, thanks? Oh, how fun. $4.49. It's just called, it just says it's a volumizing waterproof mascara. It, has, it, does, it says nothing about, here's what it says. Volumizing, waterproof mascara, smudge proof, long lasting washable, achieve bold, beautiful lashes. And actually it says it's $3.14 right now, but I paid $4.49. I'll have to do a price adjustment on that. But how fun. Oh, that's a tiny little wand. Oh, that's just super little. That looks more of like a, um, like a, like a, what are these up here? What, what are these called? Brows. <laughs> They're brows. So I've seen these at um, the Dollar Tree. They're having more fun like hair clips and they got like little dangly things on them. Um, and then I've seen something similar at this is actually really cute. I was kind of hoping that this was going to be a little bit bigger. But it would, it's small, but it would be very cute for like a half up, half down moment. I don't know, can you guys see it? Am I up too high? That's cute. Can you see it? FedEx is bringing my packages. So you're going to hear Ma Maggie downstairs. That's Maggie the Mastiff. She's doing her whole screaming for mom. Okay, dollar forty nine for that cute friggin' hair clip. So on this hair clip, you guys, I'm so like I said, I'm tired. All right, guys, we've got this is like metal, not like high quality metal. Like it, it does feel like I could snap the thing in half if I wanted to. We're gonna call it metal, okay? Then we got some really pretty like rhinestones on there. Hopefully you guys can see the detail in it. Metal flower shaped hair claws. Search that, you guys can find it. So who here is searching every Dollar Tree trying to find the Touchland dupe by the, the brand is called Be Pure, $1.25. So I found a three pack. I've, I've picked these up before from Timu and the one that I picked up was the, the quality on it was kind of terrible. These actually feel really nice. Like these feel very similar to the Touchland ones. Each of these have like the silicone outer. It's got a little clip on there. If you don't want the clip on there, looks like there's like a, you know, a little claw where you can un unhook the little, th this thing. Whatever this thing is called, you can remove it. And then you got the little funnel for each one. You can fill it up with your own, um, your own hand sanitizer. You can make homemade hand sanitizer. Or you can go to Dollar Tree and buy these. They have coconut, lavender, and then this citrus one. Artificial coconut can be like hit or miss for me. Usually I don't like artificial coconut. I hate lavender. So I went with the citrus. So three of them for $4.49. That's a pretty good deal. Portable travel spray bottle. Um, this one, um, since I have dogs and cats, we can get a little fur. It's called a hair sticker wand, 99 cents. 
the outer shell is kind of junky, but I would hope that that wouldn't break in my purse. Um, so you remove this little film and then, and when it gets really full, you just rinse it underwater, let it dry, and then it's sticky again. So that's what I'm kind of hoping that, that that's what this is. Um, for 99 cents, I figure it wouldn't hurt to try it. Um, that's just a mini portable hair sticker. That's what it says, mini portable hair sticker. I don't name them. Okay, and then we all know that I have a crazy, weird obsession with pens, markers, highlighters, office supplies. I get the addiction from my mother. It's passed down through the bloodline. Like, I looked into it. It's like a real thing. You can pass it through the bloodline. I hope my kids don't get it. It's a serious thing. I don't know, I don't even actually recall buying these. Like, I think I blacked out. Not trying to be funny. $4.49, four pack of them. They're called Four Piece Cute Highlighter Multicolor. They're not very specific to help you find these things. But they are kind of like aesthetically pleasing. It's not high shine. It's very, it's like matte. And it even, it's not real slippery. It feels, it actually feels really nice in your hands. And then you get the little gold, little ring that goes around where the cap you know, reaches the rest of it. It's just, like, if you have to go to, like, a, like a business meeting or whatever, bring in one of these to highlight, people would be like, oh, look at you. And you mean, like, I know. Look at me. Like, I got my poop in a group. I came prepared. But since these are so nice, I think I would go and get some other colors. Um, these are kind of cute though, you guys. They're cute. Um, very cute, right? Those are nice. I like them. Come on, brain. USB desktop fan, 6.5 inch. Portable. I don't know about you, but I get hot. And I used to think, oh, it's just a fat person thing. But I used to be skinny, and I was hot then, too. <laughs> um, so, I don't know. Some people are just, like, warmer than others. So, I like to stay cool, right? Oh, guess who got their air conditioner fixed in their car? Me. I got it fixed. But anyway, how cute is this? And one of the things I liked about it is the, how it just folds so flat. Or you can like tip it out right you can charge it take it with you if you travel basically like travel right or just sticking it in your bag if you're just a hot person you need a fan let's see how powerful usually these things come charged so not today not today they don't it's 6.99 for this little this little fan i've bought their fans before i have a couple of them one that's like a little tower one it sits on top of your desk um, you can have it upright or you can have it sideways. You guys remember when I got that? That's a pretty nice little fan. My daughter almost stole it and took it to her dorm. That's how cute it was. But I know I don't have really good luck with um, Timo Electronics. Um, they fail me more times than they work for me, but I have bought things, electronics from Timu that have worked just fine. So um, it's just kind of a hit or miss with Timu, but they do have a really good return policy. I feel like we should charge this. Should we charge this? I feel, no, this would be a good, let's review this on, um, this would be one of the things we can review. Like, how long does it take to get to a full charge? How long does it run on a full charge? Does it overheat? These are the things we want to know. And I will get to the bottom of it. I will. I got high hopes for that. I think I'm going to do this in every video, just in case you guys are new here. i show you guys my little trick on how to save money with Timu. Let me pick something and I'll show you. Okay, so here's how you can make sure you get the best price for an item. Like, let's just say you want to buy something. Like, let's just say you want to buy this little... I just did a Timu haul and this was on it. So here's that bag. You know, so you want to scroll through all the pictures and find the best picture. Like, that's a good picture of it. And then um, you click on the picture. So then now it's just the picture. And then up here in the corner, there's a little icon up there that looks like a camera. Right there, that little icon that looks like a camera. You're going to click on that 
it scans the picture and then now it shows you all the sellers that are selling that bag or a bag that's very similar to it. Um, and then you can like pick the best price. I'd like to try and show that. I didn't know a lot of you guys didn't know didn't know that. So I'm going to try and do that on every time I do a Timu haul. So I have been picking up these little travel bags. Sometimes they're amazing. Sometimes they're, they're horrible. So this thing intrigued me just because it's silicone. Like the whole thing is silicone. This is so nice that you can like wipe it clean. If it gets wet, like it's going to like you know what I mean like it's just kind of it's kind of cool so it's called a silicone toiletry bag travel portable three dollars 49 cents it's totally worth the three dollars and 49 cents metal pull but a plastic zipper little loop on here maybe you could hook it onto something or whatever yeah this is kind of cool but you know like it's you guys get what I mean like it, the whole thing is silicone and then just pops right back open. This seems nice. It's not where it really, it doesn't feel junky. It actually feels like really good quality. I like that it's food safe. Like you can like pack snacks in it. It's kind of nice. So I got a pack of these rings. They're, they're five piece or I got gold and silver. Am I doing it right? Yeah, gold and silver. <laughs> five piece minimalist style stacking rings. $2.18 for the silver and $1.74 for the gold. They're just a, they're just skinny bands. That's all they are. Sometimes, you know, I'm, I want to wear like, like chunky rings and sometimes I just want just something skinny, something more dainty, you know. It's just a little band. You know, like some of us that have got like curvier hips, but you got smaller waist or you have a kid they're growing. I always had that problem with my kids because they, they're, you know, we're, we're a tall family and my kids were always like so skinny and they would gr grow so fast. So they had long legs, but they were tiny, but you'd have to buy them bigger clothes so they would fit them lengthwise, but they would be too big in the waist. So I would always have to take the waist, fold it in, add a stitch, and then if needed, I could like pop it out and like as they were filling out the pants um so i did that a lot also you know just to save on money too like they can wear the pants longer just roll them up on the bottom you know take in the sides and as they get bigger just take it out i did a lot of that so this stuff this is what they're calling it one pair detachable flower buckle waistband tightener dollar 37 this is black they had different colors too like a push pin with the backing. So that'd be interesting to try. It doesn't feel like real cheap. Like, cause you don't want these to bend real easy. Like when you go to bend over, all of a sudden you're, the thing just like folds in half. Only thing I would worry about is how well are those backings gonna stay on there? Cause if they pop off, you're gonna, you're gonna have a problem. Hold on, let's see how easily these backs come off. They don't come off very easy at all. Nice. Um, so it's not like they're just going to come off in your pants and then you're going to get impaled. So that's always a good, it's a good day when you don't get impaled, right? $2.69. They're called Sparkling Hollow Circle Design Hoop Earrings. Sometimes I feel like just plain hoops. Oh, I'm actually wearing hoops today. I got pearls in today. I got a whole drawer over there of just like hoops. Gold hoops, silver hoops, rhinestone hoops, chunky rhinestones, thin rhinestones, pearls, little pearls. Like, I got them. Love them. So I thought this was a good size. They got silver or gold. I'm more of a silver. Did I say $2.69? Right now they're $1.70. So a whole dollar off. Should do a price check on that. Did you guys know you can do price adjustments? I really need to do a video where I show you guys like tips and tricks and stuff on like how to do a return, how to do price adjustments. You can do price adjustments for 30 days after you made you bought something. So if it goes on sale 30 day, within 30 days of after you purchase it, um, you can click on price adjustment and then it'll refund you or I think they could just give you like credit. Um, for the difference. This is a one piece electronic digital case, $3.67. Right now it's $2.68. They come in black, navy blue, gray, and pink. I got gray, I believe. 
I thought this would be good. Like you're just overnight going somewhere um, where you just want to put maybe your earbuds in, your phone charger, your extra battery pack, which, you know, those little square things you, holds charge, you know, whatever they're called. I don't know. I'm working on half power up here, but it's just like a small one fit whatever you want in there you got a couple different pockets this actually feels really nice this doesn't feel real junky this actually feels really nice for two dollars and 68 cents i could see something like this in the store being like ten dollars fifteen dollars you guys this this is a good one i like this a lot okay i like that i'm so tired so the puppy sleeping at night she's been doing pretty good um we keep her in like a little little tiny kennel and then we keep it covered with a blanket we did this with maggie too and then if she wakes up in the middle of the night like i'm right next to her and when she wakes up we don't talk to her we, we like stay really quiet i don't even lift the blanket up i just stick my hand under the blanket and i put like a finger or two like in the in the side of the kennel like just through the little holes and then she comes over and she sniffs and like licks my finger. And then she like rests her hand, her head on the, my fingers and she goes right back to sleep. She's doing really good. She's doing really good. Really, we're trying to stay on top of potty training. I'm pretty good. We're pretty good with potty training. We can get them potty trained by the time they're four months old. Where's one time I was really proud? <laughs> because we got our dog, we can potty train our dogs pretty good. Like we're, we're real consistent with... As soon as they wake up, right after they eat, and then right after they play. Like, always, like, take her outside, take her outside. Okay, it's been two hours, get her outside. Like, we're pretty consistent with it, and they can catch on really quick. Like, she's smart. So there was one year, I think it was when, with Maggie, when we first got Maggie, when she was just a little pup, bringing her in for her, her vet appointment. I brought her in, and I was so proud at four months old, like, my dog's potty trained. So we go in, and she's like, how's everything going, da, da, da. And I'm like, good, she's potty trained. Yeah, we got her all potty trained. And she's like, well, I would hope so. She's four months old. Okay. I was looking for a praise, like, oh, wow, that's great. Good for you, Heather. Way to go. You did it. Anyway. I wonder which one they duped. They duped Maybelline. Yes, they sure did. So this this is the original. This is Maybelline. And then they did a whole like copycat kind of moment. Like, I can't think of an original idea. I'm going to steal your idea. That's that's what they did with, with this. Let's see. I don't see any similarities, do you? Um, and then they call theirs babe skin. And this is baby skin. Let's just do a quick comparison. Like, there's Maybelline. This one next to it. Ooh, it's cream. The Kenya Babe Skin is cream, like creamy, and then the Maybelline one is more like the silicone. So putting that on, it, it just feels like a, a thick, like, silicone type of a primer. I mean, it just blurs everything. But this one by them... It doesn't, it just feels like a moisturizer, um, but it'll be fun to try. I'm, I'm not trying to, I'm not dissing them, but I'm just saying the, the texture wise is completely different. I don't know if they were just wanting to copy the, the packaging just so you, you know, like, oh, yeah, what? I'm really tired. So I'm having um, troubles finding the words. Plastic spoon, spoons and forks are like totally horrible, right? Like too much plastic. I know I'm one to talk. I buy a lot of plastic acrylic, you know, organizers and things like that. But wooden, wooden cutlery. Like would this be any good or would it just be a nightmare? Or is it going to taste like you're eating wood? These are the things I want to know. But you can get a whole big pack. $6.43. It says it's a hundred piece. Got some knives and spoons. And then a bigger pack of the forks. It smells like wood. It actually smells really nice. But I mean, it, obviously, if you're going to leave your 
wooden spoon in your really hot soup and just let it soak. It, it's, it might soak up some of that stuff, but sometimes you're eating on the go. You don't want to grab one of your forks. Seems like my forks go missing. I don't know where they all are. I really don't. Like what happened to all my forks? Do they, do they accidentally get thrown away? I don't know. Let's order, let's open up the next bag. How are we doing on time? We good? We're good. We're doing all right, guys. We're doing all right. Anybody left in there? Nope. All right. Where are you? Where are you? Okay, those are old ones. Oh, here. No, is that it? Oh. So in here, I got this jade eye mask. $5.61. Wait, what? Like, what does that do? The jade on your face? I thought by looking at the picture, it's like, it, I kind of think I know what that is going to look like, but what are the best, why is it triple wrapped? Oh, oh, there we go. Ooh, it feels nice and cool. So that part I could kind of see, but what is the jade part? Like, are there some like healing properties to that? Looks like it's just something you lay, uh, like while you're laying down. You put on your 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 skincare and it's like a, a spa moment. Like I could that could put you to sleep. Just the weight of it. It's not like super heavy, but just the coolingness of it. You know? Very moldable and pliable. Put that thing in the fridge. Ooh, right? It's gonna bring some swelling down. It just looks like it has some like you know, like clear beads on top, just for like decorative. And they got different colors too. Black, clear, they got um, rose quartz, amethyst, obsidian, green adventuring, yellow tiger eye. I mean, I could easily just like Google it and look it up on the different healing things that they, they all claim that they can do. Um, but either way, the $5.61 for this, I'd say that's totally worth it. Bohemian style raffia flower earrings, $3.14. They had so many different colors in these. They had ones that were like red, white, and blue, um, three different shades of blue. They had khaki, oranges, greens, purples. A black and white one. These were just very summery, very fun. And they, it looks like they have a little bit of like metal on the back of them. I've been seeing these all over, all over Timu. I think they even had like a white one or maybe a beige one. Just like a little basket. Whether it's like a catch-all in your bathroom. Maybe you want to like throw all your makeup in there or or maybe like your cat's toys or whatever. Feels really nice, it's like rope. You know those rugs that are like woven that look like this? That's what it feels like, that that type of material. $4.78. Ooh, and then they can get, you can get like a, a, like a bigger one with wooden handles and then two smaller ones that go inside of it. That's actually really cute. Look at this. Those are cute. $23.84 for that three piece. It's a three piece handmade rope woven storage basket with handle. $4.78 for this little guy. Totally worth it. I'm always picking up acrylic organizers. I think it's one of my, my problems that I have. But is it really a problem if you enjoy it? I don't think so. I'm not hurting anyone. Just the planet with all the plastic. I know, keep your opinion to yourself. Anyway, so this is $5.97. It's a one-piece eyeshadow palette organizer. I think I picked these up before. This feel, it feels nice. Decent quality, totally worth the $6. It's totally worth the $6. It's worth it. You know one of the cool things um, that is great with having like a small breed um, one, their food, food is less expensive. Their poops are little. Um, and then I like buying her sweaters for the winter. I'm gonna buy her so many sweaters. So anyway, um, so I got a lot of dog stuff coming for, for my little baby. Couple of makeup things. I think I'm just gonna save these things. And like, we're gonna go over these makeup items. 
like when we do the the makeup review I did pick up some cute little Hello Kitty makeup brushes I couldn't help it okay I just couldn't help it so the Hello Kitty makeup brushes two dollars and 89 cents and then I got some cream blush I'm not, gonna, I'm not even gonna get these out like I got a cream blush another blush a jelly lipstick and then this is like a velvet lip tint matte like a beige like a nude lip you know but it's like a liquid lipstick it's just another makeup item but i seriously i'm not gonna pull them out just because we're gonna do that makeup review and then we'll look at them then i love exfoliating you do need to be careful you don't want to over exfoliate you're gonna ruin your skin barrier i saw these little small little loofahs i didn't know if they were gonna be soft enough to use on my face you can either get them in packs of 12 24 or 40. I got a 12 just to try them out. Natural loofah um, sponge pad for face, body, gentle scrubbers. But you get a little 12 pack of them. They seem decent. What are they? $2.79. I paid. Yep, $2.79. Another makeup item. This one I want to look at though. Let's just, we're just going to look at this one just real quick. Just real quick. The other ones were kind of boring. They were just like plain lip product or a plain blush. This looked kind of cool. Hold on. They're, they're, they're duping Charlotte Dill. They're, they're copying everybody. <laughs> they're copying everybody. Um, but this looks just like Charlotte Tilbury. So, um, wow, that looks so pretty. So that'll be fun to try out. I'm not going to do it now. Don't don't swatch it, Heather. Leave it in there. Don't, don't swatch it. $4.94. It's called Contour Magic. Oh, it says it was discontinued. Dun, dun, dun. Did you get shut down? I'm telling you, it happens. A lot of people think like, oh, those are hourglass makeup brushes. No, they're not. They are not. They are not. Okay, so you guys have all seen those little, they almost look like a mint. They're like, they're circle white. Once you hydrate it, then you're able to open it up and it's like a, a little paper towel that's damp. You can like wipe your hands or clean your, your little kid's sticky face or whatever you need it for. I saw this and I thought this was really cool. Oh, look at it. You can put the little, um, well, how do you get it out? Wait, shut your face. Shut your face right now. How do you get that out though? Oh, okay. Got it. Got it. Got it. Okay, you guys, look at this. <laughs> I think it's cute. And right now, looking at it, it's everything I imagined it would be. And more. $3.49. It's called Portable Compressed Towel Humidifier. So you fill this part up with water. Okay, hold on. The fun part's coming. You open up the bottom, which is just like a little... Darn it! I forgot about gravity, okay? I forgot about gravity. But anyway, you would wanna go like this and then open it. Don't do what I just did. Take your little cap off, put your little compressed towel in this little tray. And then you pump this and it pumps the water up and then it hydrates your little towel for you. You guys, oh, look at what it comes with. The excitement just keeps getting more and more. You have this thing. Where does this hook? Oh, right into the side. There's like a little thing and then you can like... But I saw that and I thought that was really clever. Now you don't need it. It's a want thing. It's not a need. You want it. You want this. You don't need it. You want it. Totally worth a $3.49. I wouldn't pay more than like, you know, 4 or $5 for it. It's just a... Feels like a decent quality though. Totally worth it. Yeah, then you can buy the compressed towels. You can get like a hundred pack for $3.48. You would just want to make sure you've got the um the size right that it's gonna fit in there. That's kind of cool. All right, so let's pull up the next order. Let's get this one. I have that one tape dispenser that we need to review. Wait, I think I need to change my battery. I'll be right back. Okay, are we are we in the same position? Okay, so we have that other tape dispenser that we have to review that is more of like a um, like gift wrap tape. 
that type of a tape dispenser. And then I've got this one where it's like the packing. $6.97. The color is watermelon. Totally unnecessary. One piece handheld packaging tape dispenser. And then, and then you're probably like, but Heather, yeah, it's a cute pink tape dispenser. I wish you had um, pink tape. I did it. I did it. I did it. I got some pink tape as well. Just one of these, $2.98. Is it worth it? No. Does it go with this? Yes. Um, alarm clock, you guys. You have got to see this. I really hope it's this. It's a pink LED clock for room. $13 though and 49 cents. I'm not sure about that. We're gonna see how adorbs it is. If this thing is like super adorbs, you see when I'm like shortening the word adorable, it makes me feel like I'm younger and more hip. It's adorbs. I think my kids years ago taught me YOLO. You only live once. So then I was like, okay, am I supposed to say YOLO? When you do something fun, YOLO, what? Played like a decent long cord. Like how long is that? That's pretty long. That's gotta be like 10 feet long. Nice. Okay, it looks like you can also have it be a wall mount, a remote for it where you can set the time, an alarm, the brightness, power on off. Oh, this is gonna be fun to play with. I love that it comes with a user manual. Manual? Did I just say manual? Comes with a user manual. Manual? I mean, I know it looks like solid pink. So it's going to glow like at night. But are you going to be able to see the time during the day? I want to know. I really want to know. Oh, we're playing with this later. We're going to play with that. See if it's worth the $13.49. I'm going to guess that things like this are gonna be mainly cool at night. Like nighttime, the room's dark. Ooh, you can kinda see what time it is across the room. That's it. Okay, you guys know my favorite bracelets that I have. I don't think I got my favorite bracelets in this order, but I got, I found different ones. If I want a bracelet, I only search ankle, ankle bracelets. Um, just because their regular bracelets come so small and I don't like a snug, bracelet and um, I found a bunch of stuff. Let me go grab my my favorite bracelets just for those people that are not that are new here that you've never you don't know like what my favorite bracelets are. I'll leave just a link right at the top of my description that says my favorite bracelets um, but you get a, t a pack like this they come in it you can get like one three five twelve um, I always get a 12 pack but they look like this they look so nice on your wrist um, but this is this is ankle like I mean yeah I'm a little chubby but um, I'm six foot one so if the wrist fits wear it right so that's my favorite bracelet I get compliments on them all the time but anyway so what I did find are ones that they're ankle ones they're just a little bit bigger of a rhinestone than these tiny ones. And I had bought one a while ago and I thought, well, if it comes and it's cute, then I'll go back and I'll order the other ones. So this is another stretchy. So this is the size that I usually get. This is the one that's my favorite. So then they had these ones in the ankle size that's just a little bit bigger. In a single strand, a double strand. I already have the triple. I already bought the triple width one. And then this one is four and this one is five. Where they're like this, but they're bigger and they're stretchy. Yeah, those are nice. Ooh, look at that, so cute. So these are really fun. I think five was the biggest one. I believe I got them all. Um, so I got the one, two, three, four, five. Um, so those are fun. These ones look nice and big. These are gold. 
but sometimes I want a gold bracelet to match my gold earrings. Usually I mix it up. I like gold and silver. I'll just mix it all up. So these ones, they're bigger than my favorite ones. They're gonna be more of like the silver single strand like I just showed you, but they're gold. Yeah, perfect. Fits great, nice and loose. Dollar forty-eight each. Oh yeah, oh wait, let's go over those prices. The five one is a dollar thirteen. The four is a dollar seventy-five. The two is a dollar thirty-one, and the single one is fifty-one cents. And then I don't remember what the the three one was because I had already bought that just to test it out to see if I liked it, to see if the size was okay, and then if it was, then I was gonna buy more, which I did. A two pack ultra soft microfiber bath towel set. I was like, huh. I can always use a bath towel, especially with the baby. Luxury two-piece bath towel set, ultra absorbent, microfiber, soft waffle weave, quick dry for spa, gym, or travel. Oh, interesting. It's more of like a blanket. Maybe I'll just use this for the baby. It feels more like a blanket. It's got that rope, it's got the roping around the whole thing. What's kind of cool is that it does have that little a little loop in the center of it. So if you needed to like hang it up, it's kind of more like a blanket. This might be for the baby. I'm gonna put it down over her bed. I bought her a little bed to keep down there. The two of these, what did I say? $13.49, not even $7 each. They're super soft, but they don't look like a towel to me. They look like a blanket. I don't know, but they do see, they seem nice. I, I like that edging with the, the rope around it. Um, be, it could be your fancy gym towel when you go to the gym. But you could have your little fancy towel that you take with you. Good. So I got this scrunchie in my previous order. I did get another one. There, It's a chiffon headband hair tie. I don't know why they call it headband. Um, it's a hair tie, like a scrunchie. So I did get another one. I know you're supposed to, you know, like satin is supposed to be best for your hair versus silk. Satin is better for your hair versus silk. If you have silk, silk is absorbent. Satin doesn't absorb. So if you're dealing with like dry, frizzy hair, things like that, satin is the way to go. So this, it's not satin. I don't think this is satin or silk. I think it's probably just polyester, but um, it's so big. Like I have very thin hair and when I do a bun, I put this on there, it really kind of makes my tiny bun bulk, it bulks it up, it bulks it up. Oh, very bulky. Get you a bulky bun. Help you add some body to that, that bun. You guys seen those things? It's a quick clothing fixer, $5.49. This is used for so many things. It throws in like a quick little stitch. Now, the one that I'm really wanting is the one that actually throws in like a fabric stitch. It's just like a little, not plastic. I'm looking for one that is like a, like actual thread where it just throws in, just like pops a little, a little threaded stitch. Um, this is plastic. So this will be fun to try to see like, is that, is that even like a good thing? The tablecloth, you gotta just make it work. You gotta make, you know, like you wanna, it's dragging on the floor. So like pick it up, click it, click it, like a little stitch to hold it up just temporarily. And then you can like remove it later. They've got these little latches. I don't know, these little clasp thing. I don't know what these are for, but then you got a whole row of these like little, the little, the things that, I, I don't know. <laughs> and they look very handy to have around when needed. It'll just be fun to try it. I have no idea if this is a good buy or not. $4.37 right now. I paid $5.49. Um, I'm sure you might be able to find them even cheaper. But um, I don't know. Either way, we'll try it out. We'll, we'll test it and we'll see how, if it's worth it or not. Or is it just kind of like a ridiculous thing? But we'll see. <laughs> Oh yeah, did I say that that, that little scrunchie? $3.49. This beach bag. Yes, I've been buying a lot of bags and travel things. Well, I see them and they look interesting to me, so I buy them. 
So different beach bags, different price points. Like my, my recent Timu haul, I bought the bog bag dupe. Um, I will be buying a real bog bag and I want to compare the two. Um, but this one, this thing's only $10. So having a beach bag, one, it's clear. I love having clear bags, especially for travel. Like you can see where something is. You can just go like, oh, here it is. It's right here. Instead of like digging in your bag and you get so frustrated. I can't find it. Where is it? I don't know. Well, I thought you... Right. Right, we've all been there. So having something like this, maybe? Wipe it out, hose it down, clean it up. I don't know. I'm not sure what these little holes are for the side. I think the other one has got like blue and maybe green straps. And then they had the pink and the yellow. Nice little size. I do like that it has that zipper inside. That was $9.99. It's extra large. I think they also had a different size. This thing, this looked really cute. I couldn't really tell by the picture if it was going to be um, adorable or is it just made to look adorable and then when you get it you're like oh no that's awful so let's see shall we it's a flower pattern corduroy makeup bag i was kind of hoping it was going to be like like stitched and i bet you could do that though like just follow the pattern like it's just printed on there but i bet if you had like your cross stitch type of thread you could go on here and like add some thread to make it more like 3d that'd be kind of cute it does have a nice metal gold zipper a decent lining in there it's not too bad three dollars and 29 cents flower pattern corduroy makeup bag okay so you guys remember in my last timu haul i opened up that pink bag that holds your Stanley or your Stanley dupe whatever um, and then on the other side it had the compartment you know you can carry your Stanley around with some other stuff or do you just want to throw your Stanley over your shoulder water bottle whatever I say Stanley because you guys know what I'm talking about but whatever water bottle six dollars and 98 cents seems decent like it, this seems like this is put together quite well um, it's adjustable three different snaps depending on the size it's got, it does have like one little pouch you could fit a quarter in there but then it has this little strap you can uh carry and it completely swivels all the way around Put your water bottle over over your shoulder wrap that around your stanley your, your water bottle and off you go 6.98 oh, it looks like this Oh, you just wrap it around your water cu your cup with the handle. You can get beige, black, and then pink. But I don't know, maybe other sellers might have other colors. So I think this thing is supposed to be like for lunch meat or cheeses. And I've seen people um, get these on Amazon. Um, I mean, yeah, I could easily tell you guys to go buy this on Amazon. Here's my Amazon link because um, I am an Amazon influencer. I'll be launching my Amazon storefront here pretty soon. Um, I just need to do a few more finishing touches to it and then we're gonna do an Amazon video. We're gonna be giving away Amazon gift cards um, when I launch my Amazon storefront. But um, if there's a better deal on Timu, I'm gonna tell you where to get the better deal. Um, so I thought I'd get this from Timu because the ones on Amazon are kind of pricey. This is $11. So you get a lid and then people are putting like, like their ham there, maybe their American cheese there and maybe roast beef on the bottom or whatever. And it's like this is where you keep all your lunch meats. But this feels like nice quality. It seems really nice. Um, I would totally get that. Um, they seem pretty, they pretty, sorry, I'm like so tired. <laughs> They seem decent, um, and this seems like really nice quality. Um, I don't know, is it necessary to have a separate compartment for your lunch mates and your cheeses? I don't know. But if you're someone that makes sandwiches all the time, just to have your meat and your cheese, like all, and why not? <laughs> okay, look at these cute earrings. $3.98 for these. I love these because they mix gold and silver together. They're called One Pair Exquisite Zircon Decor. 
I don't even know. They're saying a bunch of words, but these are earrings. Those are really pretty. I like those a lot. I like them a lot. Okay, and then I've seen these portable hand washing soaps. Dollar four for a hundred of them. I don't know about these. Like, have you guys tried those? You add water and they get all sudsy, but you better not touch any of these with wet hands. <laughs> right? Like, does that just seem silly? And does it seem like one is enough? Petal soap paper. I've seen like that soap paper, add water, get them, oh. To me, it seems like you need like 10 of them. I don't know about that. I wanted just to get them to try them out. They're pink, they had different colors. Dollar four. <laughs> I don't know about those. This is that watermelon niacinamide serum, that glow recipe. That's that dupe that I have. They, they're, um, they're, they're, they're stealing. They're stealing ideas from other other companies. They're doing it again. $4.99. I'm not going to get it out. We'll do that. We'll look at that when we're doing the whole friggin' makeup thing. I got two more makeup items. Although, I did... So this is... What is this? It's a blush ball. It's like a blush stick. You know, that's all that is. We don't need to get that out, right? We don't need to get it out. I'm so tired, you guys. I just want to go downstairs and cuddle my dog. I'm so tired. Wait, what is this? Oh, okay, bronzing beads. You guys, you know what I miss? I'm gonna tell you what I miss. Bronzing beads from Mary Kay. I haven't used Mary Kay in years, like years. Can someone out there tell me, do they still have their bronzing beads? I love them. They were so great. I need to get them again. So I saw these. They're like little beads. I think they're calling these blush beads. Altai Tone Powder Blush Pearls. $3.14. We'll play with it later. I got two more things and they're big things. What is this then? I thought it was some... Oh, it's this. I kind of see it as... Is this going to be a waste of space in my fridge? It's this... It's like a Lazy Susan for your fridge. It doesn't just spin. It comes forward like it does this whole like motion thing where you can like pull it forward, rotate it, put it back. I, I don't know. There's it, It's complicated, right? You move it side to side, then you go like this kind of a thing. And, right. Eight bucks. I saw it on Amazon. I want to say it was like 20 some dollars on Amazon. I saw someone do like a little video of here's here's this really cool tray you can get for your fridge. Yeah. And I saw it and I was like, hey, that's kind of cool. And then I went to Amazon. I was like, no, thank you. Like the price for that stupid little tray. I was like, what? So then I'm, I'm on Timu and I was like, hold, hold a phone. Timu's got it for eight bucks. And it doesn't seem like it's real junky got little suction cups too to help hold it in place that we're gonna have to try we're gonna have to test that out we're gonna have to see how good that is okay last thing you guys are gonna you're gonna want to stick around for this one last item can you please load i don't have patience do you guys remember dial up the internet dial up internet remember take you forever to get something to load and then someone would call and knock you offline You'd have to buy like internet minutes, remember? <laughs> That's crazy. Okay, so I do a lot of editing, okay? I'm editing like all the time. Anyway, so I'm sitting a lot editing, like a lot. And I wish I could just stand and edit. Like I wanna stand up, but I can't, I gotta sit down. So it's this laptop adjustable, I'm thinking that's what this is. I'm not sure if that's what this is. Or is it something that I can also edit when I'm sitting in my recliner, like at night when we're watching a movie, but maybe I just want to keep editing a little bit more? Or is it going to be one of those desks that rises up? I can't remember. Is that what I got or what did I get? I'm not sure if I overpaid on this. It's $35.95. Oh, let me see what it is. I'll show you. Here we go. How 
the heck do you get this to go? Wait, what? But anyway, it's supposed to be like a lap. Maybe if you're laying in bed or if I'm sitting in my, re I have a really big like fluffy recliner I like to sit in and watch TV at night. I'm wondering if this would be like something I could like have on my lap and I could still be working and editing. Or is it something I could put on my countertop, raise the legs up taller because it does look like the legs get kind of tall on this. And then I could stand and edit. So I'm not quite sure how to get the legs to come out. They won't come out. <laughs> I don't know, like how the heck? My brain is too tired to comprehend what this is. Anyway, that's what this is. We'll look at this further when we do our review of stuff. <laughs> what is this? It comes with something else. What is in here? Charging cable. But here's what it's supposed to look like when the legs do open up. I got this big mess to put away and I got a dog to go take care of and all that other stuff. So we're going to wrap it up. Thanks so much for hanging out with me, guys, and I'll see you on my next one. Bye!